I'm almost scared to do this. Oh, God. What the fuck is this? Are you fucking serious? Anyway, to continue on with my complete takeover of Yaosh, JLoco11 here, and some of you may be wondering, how the hell am I allowed to post on Yaosh Recruits if I'm already a director on all the other channels? It's simple. I cheated. <laughs> Now, as I mentioned throughout the day, I'm doing a video on each channel on the network, and I'm doing what I call hipfire commentaries, where my friends and subscribers send me their videos, I don't watch the shit ahead of time, I don't preview it, fuck that, I like my shit raw. <laughs> so I have no clue what I'm going to get, and as you can see by this bullshit, this is certainly something I didn't expect. I mean, what the fuck? It's like... Mario noises in some Japanese office video. This is some ridiculous shit. But anyway, the gameplay comes from Epic Pineapple, who happens to qualify for Yao's recruits. So by using his gameplay, I skirted around the rules to get here, damn it. <laughs> Fuck yeah! Rules are meant to be broken. So all the other channels have content that matches the channel. You know, I have golf on Yao Sports, I have uh, like some Dungeons and Dragons shit on, on Yao's Alliance and whatever the fuck. I got home front and reloaded. But for recruits, I needed some gameplay from someone that qualified for the channel. So one of my most infamous subscribers, Epic Pineapple, sent me this bullshit. Now, people who follow my channel know who Pineapple is and his antics. He's banned from sending me videos on my other channel. <laughs> That's how bad he is with this shit. The first video he sent me was some horrible ass Mario game. And what the fuck are you doing? You're just falcon punching the shit out of all the residents in a goddamn game? Oh, Lord. It's like this dude went postal or something. <laughs> But anyway, the first video he sent me was some badass Mario. I don't even think he completed one fucking level from that game. It was that bad. His second video, though, is by far the most popular one I have on my channel. Probably the biggest fan favorite in the whole series that I did. Because in that game, he sent me some Japanese earthquake survival. I don't even know what the fuck it was. I just went off because I was cursing my ass off. I was getting pissed like you can't imagine because I just suffered through that crazy ass bullshit. On there, we had some singing. We had some chipmunks. We had some chipmunk range. Oh, man, it had everything. If you want to see a crazy ass commentary, it was all wrapped into that one video. All you have to do is do a search of J Local 11 Meltdown or whatever the fuck, and you'll be able to see just how fucking bad that goddamn video was. Final video he sent me was some Team Fortress 2 shit, and he got his ass kicked. He rage quit in the motherfucker, so I banned his ass. <laughs> fuck that. No more videos for him, but since I needed a video for Yash Recruits, I let him off the leash and I told him to send me something crazy. And of course, this is what he comes up with, and I still don't know what the fuck he's doing. He's going in from one office to- I don't even know if he knows what he's doing. That's the problem with Pineapple. <laughs> he just plays the game, he's like, I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just fucking playing it. So he's probably pressing all the buttons on a goddamn controller or the, the keyboard. I don't even know if this is on a- this can't be on a console, this has to be on a fucking- on a, a PC or whatever the hell. But he does all this crazy shit, and then he fucking sends it in, and he gets a good laugh out of me fucking cursing and raging at his dumb ass. <laughs> Look, he doesn't even know what he's doing, he's just walking back and forth. And people are jumping over him because they're fucking trying to avoid his stupid ass. You see, he doesn't even know what he's doing, he's just walking around like a motherfucker. <laughs> oh, God. Now listen, people don't, and, and I know people are going to say, Oh, can I send you my video? No, don't go sending me your fucking videos, I'm telling you that right now. You know, I only, I only accept a certain amount of videos at a certain amount of times. So otherwise, I'm going to get like 10,000 fucking videos, and I just can't do 10,000 videos over the course of a week. It doesn't work like that. So I kind of limit what I receive and who I receive it from. So with Epic Pineapple, I kind of let him off the leash a little bit, but he's still banned from my normal channel. <laughs> Hell no, I ain't letting him back on that shit. He can, he can do this motherfucker. I need him for Yash recruits. I don't need him for anything else, because then I get this crazy crap. And then on top of that, every time he wants to send me something, he wants to out... Why the hell does this dude jump so fucking high? This oh, my God. You know, I, I don't even know what to name this shit. You know, all, all the videos, I did plenty of um videos on all the other Yash channels. I know what the names of the games are, with the exception of Yash Alliance. I don't know what the fuck that shit was. It was like Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> but what do you name this? I don't know what to name this bullshit. Oh, God, man, this is, you know, I told him to send me something crazy, and this is what I get for letting this motherfucker off the leash, and now he's doing, like, some super jumps, look at it, and now even the, 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 the fat women are doing jumps, look at that shit, what the fuck, you can't even step on him like a Mario game, look, that's like a Mario ripoff right there, that looks like Mario, like Fireball Mario from the original shit, <laughs> don't it, you saw that guy, you saw that dude, but anyway, man, like I said, I'm doing the whole takeover, and there's gonna be a video on all the names, that, that dude's pissed off at you, he's punching you in the ass, but there's, um, gonna be a video on all the channels, but like I said, there's a video on Yao's main channel, there's gonna be on graphics, there's gonna be on remix, which I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do for those, but we're gonna find out later. But the final video that we ended up the day on is gonna be the Gaming for the Cause channel. Now, hopefully people know what Gaming for the Cause is. That's the channel that we use to raise uh, money and awareness for the St. Jude's Children Research Hospital. All the money we make goes towards research for the children at St. Jude's. So, 
of all the videos that I have going on today, I don't care what you do with all the other videos. If you can, please go check out the Gaming for the Cause video. That's all I ask. I mean, if you don't like this video, that's fine. But go check out the Gaming for the Cause channel because all the views that we bring in, all the favorites that we bring in, all of that raises money to go towards the children that need it. But anyway, getting back into this shit, man. Epic Pineapple, this is the reason why he's still banned. <laughs> Look at this shit, man. You don't even know what you're doing. That's the funny part. It's not even like he figured out how to play this fucking game. He's just jumping around, going and building and build. I don't even know what the fuck he's supposed to be doing. I mean, have, first of all, unless you can speak Japanese, you have no idea what any of that shit says. And you obviously can't speak Japanese, because if you knew what the fuck it says, you would know exactly where you're supposed to go other than jumping around like an asshole. But you know what? Fuck it. This is what I... <laughs> I told him to find me some crazy shit, and this is what he fucking found me, but at least he got found a video game this time, man. Because, man, that earthquake shit... Oh lord, if, if, I'm really telling you guys, if you guys ever get the urge to go check out the worst fucking video on the internet, please go check that one out, because that one will blow your fucking mind how bad that I had to do that goddamn video. I mean, I had to do a whole commentary, it was like 10 fucking minutes, that shit was just goddamn torture, man. I'll tell you, you know, there, there, there's an easy way of doing the, the hip fire commentaries. First of all, the hip fire commentaries, I've been doing these for, for over a year now, so I'm kind of used to what I'm going to see. I know a little bit about almost a lot of the video games that I got, so I, I don't play Homefront, but I know enough about it. I don't play that Dungeons and Dragons crap, but I know enough about RPGs to know what the fuck is going to happen. <laughs> you know, I had some old school gaming on the main Yow's channel. This, I don't know. I don't know if he's supposed to strangle that motherfucker right there. I think he beat his ass the first time, and now he's stepping on his death. I don't know. I really don't know what the purpose of this game is. Epic Pineapple obviously doesn't know what the purpose of the game is because he's just walking around like an asshole trying to figure out what the fuck it is. <laughs> and here's the funny shit. How come they have exit in English, but all the other text is in Japanese or Chinese? I don't know. I can't read either one. I don't know what it is. But anyway, I'm called Japanese because they make more video games. They make more of this old school shit. But anyway, so the game... How did you die? How, how the fuck did you die? Oh, Lord, man. Seriously? <laughs> He fucking died in a game. Look at this shit that had no fucking purpose. But anyway, I see this video is coming to an end. So as always, rate, comment, subscribe, and all that good shit. Like I said, complete takeover of the Yoush Network. So feel free to go check out the other videos, and especially the Game for the Cause video. And I'll see you guys in the next video.